Last night, as I went to sleep, I saw that US market was significantly higher and I happily went to sleep. And today morning when I woke up, I saw US market was down. And this is the nature of high volatile market. One day it will go up to 1000 points, one day it will come down to 1000 points and the volatility will just kill the traders. But in spite that, Asian markets are mostly green. Not significantly, but we can say that flat with the positive buyers. Japan is down, but Nifty was down by more than 200 points in the last two hours. Now we are just trying to recover at least one fourth of that. But intraday bullishness and Nifty crossed 16,400 yesterday. And that made people bullish and that bullishness was wiped out in the matter of two hours. Though this kind of selling comes in this kind of volatile market. But somehow positionally I feel this market is long and this market is not short. So coming back to market fundamentals. As I always say 7 stocks that forms the major uh, contributors. And out of that, Reliance is speculation after rising 6% and now started coming down. And then SDFC Twins, even when the Nifty crossed over 16,400 yesterday and all other banks and financials went up, but SDFC and SDFC Bank, they both were higher only 2-3 rupees only. So at the end of the day, both of them were fallen significantly. So out of 7 stocks, SDFC Bank, SDFC and Reliance looking significantly bad. And then we are left with remaining 4 stocks, ICIC Bank, Kotak Bank in Financials, TCS and Infosys in IT. In fact, it was TCS and Infosys which saved the market yesterday from collapsing. IT index gained about 1% and ICICI and Kotak, both the financials uh, did very well because uh, their financial results were good. So we have to see here these four stocks can support the market and while the remaining three are not doing well, we still have three more trading sessions. Nifty yesterday made a very big candle, downside around 16,160 and upside around 16,420 which is about 260 points range and today we can expect Nifty to trade in this range itself. So now we can just hope that yesterday's low should not be broken and if this selling continues FIAs will sell more 4,000 crores in these three trading sessions. So as per my prediction, stock-wise, don't touch any uh, stocks right now for another three days trading sessions. And for investments, I will come out with uh, some ideas in this week or next week. I hope you enjoyed listening this video. Thank you for watching.